This home is at the center of a spine-tingling mystery. A stalker known as the Watcher terrorized the homeowners with a series of chilling letters. You have children. I have seen them, the Watcher wrote. Once I know their names, I will call to them and draw them to me. Your house is my obsession, and now you are too. Now their disturbing story is being told in the Netflix drama series The Watcher, starring Naomi Watts. In real life, Derek and Maria Broaddus bought the house in Westfield, New Jersey for $1.3 million. The first Watcher letter, addressed to Mr. and Mrs. Broaddus, arrived three days later. Who has the bedrooms facing the street? I'll know as soon as you move in. It's a beautiful house. It absolutely is. I think it's everyone's dream house. Attorney Lee Levitt represented the Broaddus family, who sued the previous homeowners for allegedly failing to tell them about the existence of the watcher when they sold the house. The case was dismissed. You're moving into your dream home and you start getting these threatening letters from someone saying they're watching you and then asking for young blood. I think that's very scary. Can you keep us safe? Unlike the Netflix drama, the Broaddus family never moved in. They were just too frightened. This is the notorious Watcher house today. As you can see, it's decorated for Halloween. The search for the elusive Watcher turned neighbor against neighbor in this idyllic town of upscale homes. Some investigators believe the Watcher must live nearby. Others wondered whether the homeowners themselves were engineering an elaborate hoax. I can tell you unequivocally, that is not true. Uh, they did not write these letters. After five years of disappointment, the Broaddus family finally managed to sell the notorious Watcher House for $959,000, a loss of $400,000. The Watcher has never been identified. The final letter declared, the Watcher won.